Hello everybody, this is Nanduram and we are from Sono Academy. Today we are going to discuss about mixotrophic nutrition. Children, in earlier classes you learn about autotropic and heterotropic nutrition. In this lesson you are going to learn about that mixotropic nutrition. Mixotropic nutrition means the third type of nutrition is called mixotropic nutrition. In this type of nutrition, there is an association of two different living organisms can be seen. The nutrients may be obtained by both the organisms or only by one organism. In the former conditions, both the organisms are benefited while in the latter case, only one of the organisms is benefited of, of this association. When two organisms live together, exchange the nutrients and they are benefited mutually. The, this type of nutrition is called symbiotic nutrition. Once the organisms provide nutrients required for the other organisms, while the other provides shelter or nutrients or both. Symbiotic mode of nutrition is seen in both plants and animals. Nitrogen fixing bacteria living in the root nodules of leguminous plants is a typical example for symbiotic nutrition. Plants provide shelter and nutrients to the bacteria while the bacteria provide nitrogenous compounds to the plant. Similarly, symbiotic association is seen in leeches where algae supplies food to fungi and the fungi provides protection to algae and they live together. In the animal kingdom, the association of certain crabs with sea animals is an example of symbiotic nutrition. Sea anemones give protection to the animal while the small pieces of food particles are provided to sea anemones by the crab. In parasitism is the second type of mixotropic nutrition can be seen. The parasite is an organism which live inside is called as endoparasite or outside is called as exoparasite of an another organism is called host and the obtained of nutrients from the host organism in this mode of nutrition only a parasite is benefited. The body functions of the host are usefully affected badly due to the invasion of the parasite and the host may be even die. Points to be remembered in this lesson are an association of two different organisms to obtain their nutritional requirements is seen in symbiosis and parasitism which are examples of mixotropic method of nutrition. In symbiosis, both the organisms are benefited. In parasitism, only one parasite is benefited while the host become diseased and even die. Thank you. This is Nanduram and we are from Sono Academy.